One man is dead, another in critical condition after a wall collapse during a building demolition. Hello, and thanks for watching at 5. I'm Guy Atchley. And I'm Christina Myers. Stella Inger is off. It happened at the corner of Grant and 6th, and that's where we find 9 of your sides. Justin Shecker with more. Justin. The guy and Christina, good afternoon to you. Police detectives, OSHA officials, and city officials are still on the scene here more than three hours after the deadly wall collapse. If you look across the street behind me, you can see the roof is already gone, the back wall knocked down. Police say the excavator, that yellow piece of equipment in the middle there, was tearing down a center wall. The, the cinder blocks unfortunately tumbled on two workers with their backs to the wall. When Tucson fire medics arrived just before two this afternoon, a 54 year old man had already died. They rushed the second man who's in his 30s to UMC's trauma center. We're told he's in critical condition. The wall being torn down is about 15 feet high. Police are here interviewing two co-workers, including the foreman who witnessed the deadly wall collapse. The foreman uh, yelled out to the other uh, uh, co-worker that was standing a uh, distance away and had him call 911 immediately. He also jumped off that piece of equipment and uh, began to remove some of the big uh, cinder blocks that had pretty much covered uh, both of the And more about the employees, uh, the, more about this demolition, actually. The city of Tucson purchased this building for demolition as part of the Grant Road widening project. The company working here is a subcontractor of the city called Taylor's Demolition. Officials now are waiting to notify family before they release the name of the 54-year-old man who died earlier this afternoon. We're live at Grant 6th. I'm Justin Shecker, Kega 9 on your side.